Hello there, and welcome to a Neo Boss tutorial. Today's boss is the Great Centipede, Charlie Brown. Now friends, the Great Centipede has 100 legs and a bunch of different body segments, but he's only got one brain, and I mean to tell you it ain't all that big, and we can use his low IQ to our advantage. Let's see how to beat him. The first order of business is gonna be to cut this monstrosity down to a more manageable size. We'll pop up this ladder and hit our buddy here with a plummeting attack. This is gonna do a huge amount of damage to his body segments. Once you're down here, quickly break one and then ignore the rest of them. Different ones of them are gonna decide to run off in all different directions. It ain't important to chase them down. What is important is to find the glowing rock that's spewing all this poison out. Now go ahead and find it just as quick as you can and then what you're gonna wanna do is navigate yourself to this pillar. Friends, in my videos, there have been a number of happy little spots that we've stuck ourselves in, but I don't think in the history of this series there's ever been a more powerful happy spot than this one right here. So long as you're on this side of the pillar, he ain't gonna be able to hit you with anything, including his poison and lightning breath. The best time to run to the other side and attack him is right after he does one of these projectile attacks. If you run him while he's doing his little Pac-Man maneuver, he will get you for a little bit of damage. Keep up that little song and dance for a little while, and then, just like we did with Hino Ima, we can take down his stamina bar with our throwing stars, and then use our living weapon and just beat the devil out of him. In retrospect, you're not gonna wanna finish the stamina bar with the throwing stars, you're gonna wanna finish it off with your living weapon itself. That way he'll be stunned for the entire time you've got your living weapon out and you don't have to chase him up and down like I'm doing here. Because when he loses that purple bar, he is gonna run from you and go into a hole over here. He'll get back all his parts and he's gonna shoot at you. You're gonna wanna run up this way and hide behind this pillar here so that he can't hit you with nothing. From this point on, it's pretty much rinse and repeat. Lure him back to the spot, take out his extra body parts, kill the poisonous stone, and continue to abuse his lack of intelligence. When you beat the great centipede, that little kitty's gonna be awfully impressed with you, and then you can continue on with your adventure, knowing that there's one less giant bug out in the world. Thanks for watching today's Neo tutorial. Give it a like if you like it and subscribe if you really like it. Feel free to leave comments down below. Did I miss something? Is there a better way to beat this boss? Let everyone know down in the comments. Thanks again and have a good day.